tonight's show, we will be announcing who made it to our top three in the talent competition. At yung mananalo sa kanilang tatlo ay malalaman natin next Sunday mismo sa Coronation Night. Meanwhile, we're great. We're gearing up for another much-awaited competition dahil sabi nga ng maraming pageant analysts, mm. alam mo parang mga volleyball analysts na rin. Okay, sige. Every year, paganda ng paganda ang mga national costumes ng ating mga Bulutini. Wow! And our Kababili is here. Agree. There are 40 evidences supporting that analysis, Michelle, and we'll get to see them right after this short break. So don't go away. It is the National Costume Competition. When we return. We would like to thank the following sponsor, Dada's Mitchell, for franchise, call 0917-459-2075. x Coffee and Mango Steam, Ikmana Sarab and Healthy Coffee. Or Vanity, your lifestyle milk tea. For franchise, please call 02-374-8623. <laughs> <laughs> Beach Resort in Mariveles, Bataan. Life can be breathtakingly simple. Forty of the most beautiful Binibiris from all over the Philippines will raise their flags. Mahaba-habang usapan yan. Para dyan, San Miglay. Anong panginip niyo? May dumang mga anghel. San Miglay. What makes Dove Body Wash different? Unlike bar soaps, which cleanse the top layer of your skin, Dove Body Wash has nutrient moisture. It penetrates layer by layer to nourish your skin from deep within. For skin that feels smooth and bouncy. Dove Body Wash, now in pump bottles. Close-up. All day fresh, always ready. Don't let differences get in the way. Get close. Happy na experience. Maraming natutunan kasi iba-iba po yung nilig-store sa amin. 
Kung nagbigay ngayon ng saya at nagtagaalaman, hindi na kasi salamat sa mga nagpapasaya sa aking pamilya. years in the service of the Filipino. Welcome back to the Filipino Filipinas 2019 Brief Azure Competition. Still here at the New Frontier Theater para saksihan at sabay-sabay nating uh, mamangha sa napakagandang national costume sa ating mga Filipino. And with me right now is the very lovely Filipino Filipinas Supranational 2018, Miss Jessa Weller. Nice to see you again, Jessa. Magandang gabi sa lahat. <laughs> yes, ibinagmamalaki kong sabihin na tatlong beses kong dinahanan ang National Costume Competition ng Binibining Pilipinas. At hindi po yun madali dahil mamaya makikita niyo ang effort ng ating mga designers and Pilipinis for this competition. At ngayon ay handang-handa ng iparada sa harap nating lahat. Mga kapamilya, palabangan po at i-cheer nating lahat ang ating mga Pilipinings as we marvel on them in the Pilipining Pilipinas 2019 National Closure Competition! Pilipining Malaboy! A stylized gold Filipiniana gown! This stunning Dennis Celestial Peace recreates the sun's radiant glow! The layered mirrors are also arranged to look like fish scales as homage to the importance of the fishing industry to the city. Bini Bini Pangasinan, Daniel Magno, wears an eye-catching Glenzi Aquino creation that honors the Nuestra Señora del Santísimo Rosario de Manawar. is embellished with gold pearls, crystals, rhinestones, and hand-painted facade of the minor basilica is the highlight of this masterpiece. Binibini Munting Lupa Binibini Munting Lupa, Martina Turner Diaz takes the stage dressed as this ensemble by designer Joel Moramiso highlighting to the ideal of justice that is without regard to wealth, power, or status Martina comes out with a sword in one hand and a scale in this striking depiction of Fustitia Binibini Zamboanga, Malga Shaver. Inspired by Subana royalty, this Ardu Kamai creation done by Malga pays tribute to the tribe indigenous to Zamboanga Peninsula. Highlighted by a royal headpiece, she personifies the driving force of the proud and hard-working Subanoans. Binibini Iloilo. This perilous Nasilala national costume is designed by the father of a blown, Nono Palmas. This dare represents the beautiful yet fragile balance of the traditional and the modern. The delicate state that sacred grace Flores, home province Iloilo is in. The gown is made from the finest handwoven Iloilo fabric embellished with deep sea pearls. Bini Bini Davao del Sur, Jane Darren Holobisa wears an ensemble that inspires optimism and resilience, called Balukto, which is Makindanawan for Rainbow. It's this colorful and vibrant creation by Ahmad Kari. It is made from the Makindanao's handwoven in a oil fabric. Next is Bini Bini Rizal, in a creation by Paolo Balesteros. Honey Grace Cartasano of Rizal Province captivates in a design fusion of Barong Tagalog and Ibos, the Buri or palm leaves used to hold the Suman. Her belt is made of abaca fiber and an Ibos. Inspired headpiece completes the look. Bini Bini Dumagete. This piece called Recuerdo, adorned with sea guy seashells by Larry Ebesete, is inspired by a bygone era of early pageants and theater extravaganzas in Joanna San's province, Dumaguete. This ensemble comprises the crown, a symbol of anointed authority, a scepter, a symbol of a rule, a color cape, 
a symbol of responsibility and power, and an orb, a symbol of dominion. Filipini Negros Oriental, designer Jerry Fernandez created the La Hacendera, a traje de mestiza that epitomized the best-dressed ladies of aristocracy during the Spanish and American colonial periods. The Albay Negros Orientals Melba and Makasaya. The intricate decor harkens back to the pre-war era of stately mansions and sugarcane plantations dotting a rich Philippine history. Bini Bini Marikina, multi-awarded designer Edwin Uy, created a Kalinga-inspired ensemble for Marian Marquez of Marikina. As an amazing tribute to the dying art of the traditional tattoo and to the centenarian Wang Ud, the last master tattoo artist of the region. Bini Bini Polangi Albay, the figure hugging purple Filipiniana gown created by Frederick Burgess, is inspired by the Wali Wali, said to be the queen of Philippine flowers that is worshipped by the indigenous Magobo people as Diwata. Quite appropriate for the stunning Shane Tormes of Pulangi Albay, Binibini Talisay Cebu, Queen Juana of Cebu. This stunning Richardson of Pila creation is a tribute to the introduction of Christianity in the Spanish colonial era and their gift of Señor Santo Niño to all the Cebuanos. A depiction of the Sinulu Festival, Talisa's Gazzini Ganados costume celebrates the life, festivity of the grandeur of Cebu. Bini Bini Pasig, from the dream weavers of Sulu Archipelago, this Yakan-inspired traditional costume worn by Bini Bini Pasig Aya Abisamis is designed by Amir Sali. The Sepultangan is the most intricate design worn by women around their waist and their head. The Paju and the Sawal, seen here in unique finish, distinct patterns and colors are worn by both men and women for comfort, function, and equality. Bini Laguna, in hues of lustrous gold and electric pink, this Rene Saloon and Chico Estiva creation uses the Inaul, a traditional Maguindanao weave for the butterfly sleeve king over a columnar sheath press, a pakula crown and a scepter of burnt gold stones and crystals complete this Christian tradition meets Muslim culture worn by Laren May Bautista of Laguna, Binibini Sorsogon. Designed by Mara Chua for Maria Isabella Galeria of Sorsogon, it's a glorious depiction of the abundant sea and the iconic Butanding glowing under the benevolent moonlight. In reverence to the Bikulana goddess of moonlight, Halia. Binibini Gabanduanes. Bikulana Denise Omorog, representing Gabanduanes, Showcasing a Jan Francis Hanwagino creation inspired by Nicolandia's mother festival, the Venia Francia, considered the biggest Marian festival in Asia. Bini Bini Banan! Behold, a modern take on Princess Ordula. This creation by Pablo Mendes turns Patch McDonald of Banan into the legendary warrior princess from Pangasinan, where her maternal relatives hail. The regal ensemble is predominantly gold, adorned with gemstones, pearls, and feathers, and has a lavishly embellished sarong. Bini Bini Masmati. Inspired by the rich culture of the Cordillera in northern Luzon, this benchling young costume showcases woven fabric from the Igoro tribe and highlights the traditional bala. Bini Bini Masmati Hannah Arnold's dance incorporates prayer symbols and showcases skin snake and mountain tattoo patterns blessed by Apo Wang Ong, a glorious reminder of her proud heritage.